I have a couple of friends that have been victims of knife attacks. Fortunately, not fatally, but it had a huge impact on their lives and it pushed me to consider this problem a lot more seriously. From an any &E doctor's perspective, one of the things that makes the biggest difference is preventing the blood loss. We've got around five to six litres of blood in the average adult. You can lose that very quickly. And actually what we know is that within four or five minutes of a significant injury to a large vessel, you can die. And so anything that buys us time is absolutely priceless. So currently we pack wounds with gauze, which is very effective and we know saves lives. One of the downsides of that is actually when you remove the packing, the gauze from that wound, you can actually destabilise a clot and sometimes you get bleeding uh, resuming from that area. So it's not a perfect solution. I kind of was always interested in engineering. I knew that I wanted to come up with solutions with technology that could solve medical problems. And talking to clinical experts, people that actually respond to these events, led to me creating this electromechanical method of stopping bleeding in a knife wound. So the REACT device works in the same way as wound packing, but instead of using gauze, it uses a silicon balloon tamponade, which is pressurised once inside the wound by an actuator device. Imagine it like the balloon on the inside of a paper mache, so deflating that balloon keeps the clot intact around the outside, and then you can remove the balloon from the site. And that's exactly how REACT works. This system can guide a user through the process of applying this tamponade and that opens the doors to public use perhaps. I mean, we look at the current publicly accessible defibrillators and how many thousands of lives they're saving. I sort of want to consider a model where that could be appropriate for these stab wound devices. I think to me the James Dyson Award is about adding credibility to these innovations and as someone who has spent this entire process worrying about whether this idea is feasible, this award has really given me the confidence to drive forward with the idea and develop this product into something that could save lives.